That, that's how long you see the that they shaved his forehead to give him a hairline. Yeah. Mine's receding, but his like, seems to be growing towards his face. Are you still doing this? Push the crowd! Push the crowd! Push the crowd! Push the crowd! We also see a daily fucking tucking. We like to see this. Puck bot holes, etc., etc. Mark 5, no hood, the hood must have flown off, flown into the windshield. Then we move on to Mark 3. Interesting, five lug wheels, big dead, white, interesting, different. Air it out, air it out, air it out. Air it out, man. Watch the crowd, take a look with friends. No reason, hold back now. Was Skip from Skip Tuning. How are you today, Skip? Pretty good, thank Pretty you. Good. Now we've caught your rabbit on the street. We first saw you in a parking lot on the side, and I immediately ran over. Did you see it, Paul? I did see the Volkswagen. This is Paul from the UK. Hello. Now tell us about the car, Skip. We'll go go over the details. Whatever you want to say. Yeah, sure. Thank you, guys. Um, I've been thinking uh, to do this project, and the main idea I wanted to do is. Uh, work uh, with an engine bay shave so I got new rules for you guys today engine bay shave should not have a brake booster correct no heater hose correct no clutch wires correct okay not even a cable for the throttle body I agree don't put that on your car please hide this okay no cable for the hood neither no jugs I don't want to see nothing like this okay no fun I just don't want to see any hoses for the gas. This is the new rule 2010. Engine be, shape should be like this. Yes, sir. Now, this is what a real man does. No filter, no nothing. Now, what happens if a bird or you go on a dirt road, goes into this, picture the noise, swoosh, swoosh, suck it right in, what happens? You'll see me beside the road fixing my turbo or fixing my engine because I'm going to be fucked. I'm just like having a gun in my head and driving 15 hours back home. And we never know if we're going to make it or not. 15 hours to Canada. Right on, because I have to drive all those potholes, you know? I'm going this like this, like a rally. How many horsepower? Give us a general spec. Well, I did 415, and I, I'm still missing 40 horsepower that I want to gain with this car. But uh, it, it's a GT32 with 28 pound of boost and I did 415 who's okay because this is really light car and it's keep like no traction on the car like oh, clearly I mean I, I'm a little bit behind you in the power numbers but uh can you tell us about this intake it's a very interesting looking intake I'll just let you do the talking skip sure thanks well I, I wanted to hide the, the throttle body and most of the guy does something round to or some can or whatever but me, I said, I need to bring this throttle body as far as I can. So we tried to do this kind of headers, who's going down over there. So it's really short to the intercooler, and the response is very good. So Quick you, response to the throttle. You could do this at home now. I could do this at home. Sure. You just need to flow your runners, and from there, you have quick spool on the turbo, and you're going to burn and burn like I do, you know? Amazing. Now, tell us what's inside, because you also have a dash swap that is not popular here stateside. Can you tell us what it is? Well, you know, I don't really like Porsches, but I just like the dash of those cars. So this is a dash of a 996 uh, Porsches. So I, I installed that into my car. Well, thank you for your time, Skip. I've enjoyed you. speaking with you, and uh, I look forward to see you doing ridiculous burnouts in this car, as I'm sure everyone around us does. Let's have an applause for Skip. Thank you.
have the chromosexual card. The man behind the legend here, actually the legend himself is Paul. How you doing? Smeg more chromosexual, smeg more whatever. This is the man, see, 40 years old about. Dashing good looks, glasses. He makes a lot of money, ladies, and he's available, correct? Yes, this is true. Now let's get a look at the car. It's on a trailer, but I saw him driving it around. Why is it on a trailer? What happened? It's the trailer queen. We want to talk to Adi here for a minute. He came all the way from Germany to be at our show. Uh, he flew out to Seattle and then drove from Seattle all the way across the U.S. of A. to be here today. And thank you for coming. I'm, I'm glad I met you the other night. Hopefully we could get shit faced together later, right? Dude, I'm going to get that alcoholic when I keep up the pace here. We have Sofa. What's going on, Tob? Good to see you, my friend. Sporting these shades, I didn't even know where you were. Yes. At the arcade. Yes, sir. Okay, well, where's your car? Uh, it's right here. Okay, the Sofa Mobile. 16 valve. It's the doobie machine, basically. <laughs> this is where the doobies get rolled, smoked, puffed, and fluffed. It's all about that. Well, yes, Tom is a heavy smoker. We also see a lovely decal on the hood, Rabbit GTI, and look, it's ripped for pleasure. That booty. That booty. The plate, the car, the man, now everyone's seen it all, and everyone can go home. There's nothing else to see here. Hi. Here we are with Graham. He's straight from the UK. He imported the car over with him. Now, last time we saw this car on the forums, it was a beautiful baby blue car. Now, you've given it some patina the last year. Describe how you achieved all this rut. <laughs> Let us see.